Bob, I am very grateful to be in Chicago with you today. And, and in my soul, I'm feeling, you know, I'm feeling a bit of harmony. However, there's more harmony than just in my soul today. Absolutely. I think you have a new control that's called the harmony control. Would you mind sharing with me, because I'm ready to learn, but coinciding with the audience might listen as well, mm. and educate me on this harmony control, because it looks really, really cool. Well, first of all, there's you know many controls out there, and we partner up with all of them, most all of them. Um, our main partner is Fanuc, so we all of our machines are standard with a Fanuc control, but Siemens and Heidenhain and Mitsubishi, there's several brands out there. But as the controls are advancing and the machines are advancing, the user interface becomes so important and the technology embedded into the control. Uh, we're standing in front of a five axis machine and we put this control as a standard feature now because of its power. There's a lot of power packed into this uh, new development from Watchion. Uh, it's almost like uh, you don't even need an offline computer system anymore. It's all built into the machine. Uh, it has conversational programming or draw, draw programs built into the machine. Collision protection. So many times, you know, we buy an expensive machine like this and the collision prevention is so important. So you buy um, product off the shelf and you try to make your machine safer. Well, with Watchion, it's 100% safe because it's our model built into the software, real time. The machine checks the tools, the, the datum points on the, on the machine itself, and it's truly collision proof. So you're not going to crash your machine. Uh, that, that's just one feature. There are many features built into this. It's very intuitive. It's almost like having an iPhone on here. You just know exactly what buttons to push. Uh, that's what we kind of designed the software behind. And we're going to start putting this Harmony control system on our more advanced machines, starting with this M1 that we're standing in front of, and then we'll migrate that into all of our other five axis machines and then our high-end machines, and maybe even into our entry-level machines, as time will tell. Two things I want to say. One, thank you. I didn't know, it's about time somebody realized that we're all on our phones all the time and we <laughs> understand how apps work. And the second thing is, how new is this? Is this really new? Is this six months old, a year old, five years old? How new is this technology? No, we have a complete history of HMIs on, on uh, the CNC machine tools that we designed. I believe we started in 2012 with our smart technology. And that was our own PC-based front end. Uh, and we put it on artificial intelligent type machines. And then as history progressed, we started adding more and more software suites, uh, different developments for five access for other applications. And uh, we brought the first Harmony to the US uh, 20, what was the last time, TS 2022? And uh, we debuted it. That was our version one Harmony. So we kind of launched it then but since then, more software development from Watchion, and uh, this is now version two, and it's ready for full five axis. Every product that we have, we can implement the Harmony control on it. Well, again, apparently two is my answer for everything today. The first thing is you mentioned 2012, which means there's history to it, which means if there were bugs, they've been worked out. If there were kinks, it's been worked out. You released it just recently as we move forward. And then secondly, you mentioned just like all of us, you blink an eye and technology has left oh, us yeah. behind again and we're trying to learn. So you're constantly redeveloping and relearning and making it better and implementing it on all the machines so it's just common theme. And I think that's important for everyone to understand because with FANUC being all over and we want to be familiar with the control, you have adapted a control that implements familiarity of phone, FANUC in the background, and also a really intelligent piece of of software here that allows us to be a bit more confident because Bob, I don't know if you've sat in a machine just like I have or not, but when you do that slow roll in the machine to make sure I'm not gonna crash, that was my crash prevention before. And to have this here, that collision so much better. We presented this to the customers and everybody was blown away how easy it is to use, how quickly you can learn to use it, and all the system solutions built into the machine. Uh, everything from service, everything to monitoring, which we just looked at, 
and uh, down to crash protection, conversational programming, the whole nine yards. People are going to love this control. Well, much like the conversational programming of this machine, you have made my conversation easy as well. So thank you so much for doing Very that. Good. For everyone watching, this is incredible technology. When we keep thinking about programming from the machine, making changes, making sure we don't crash. I used to use the wheel and a piece of paper for crying out loud. This is the future, this is the now. And this is how we compete on a global level by keeping machines running, by keeping them productive, by keeping part costs low because all material costs and everything else is going up. So let's do it the right way. Let's do it the right way the first time as well. Bob, thank you so much for allowing us thank to you. share your story and your technology with our audience. And thank you all for watching. We definitely appreciate you.